The 21st century employee needs to don multiple hats simultaneously with great dexterity. The employee needs to be a strategic thinker, a great planner, and a decision maker with a willingness to collaborate and take risks in an uncertain environment. Stratup is a first of its kind multiplayer role playing business simulation game. The game simulates a risk free business environment with all its nuances, such as organizational politics, strategic planning, budgeting, and execution for all players to experiment and explore in a risk-free environment. While playing the game, you would be in a position to exhibit your critical thinking, problem-solving, and decision-making skills. In Stratup, you along with your friends virtually run an organization by assuming the roles of the heads of departments of marketing, operations, HR, IT, strategy, and finance. In the game, you along with your friends run a manufacturing firm which is into producing toy cars. The company has completed one year of operation and the board has constituted a new team comprising of you along with your friends. You take over from the old guard to run the firm along with your friends. Let me quickly take you through the first year of operations to give you a perspective and to set the context. Let us look at this infographic to understand more about the case. The company was founded in 2016 by a former Force One champion, Sundar Kartigayan. Fast Cars Private Limited is one of the fastest growing toy manufacturing company in the year. In the first year of operation, they had a revenue of about 6.98 crores and having a set up a plant in Northtown, the total capacity of the plant is about 1.35 lakh units, while the current capacity is about 35,000 units. This helps you give you a perspective of the overall capacity of the plant and your ability to augment the capacity. In the first year of operations, the company recruited about 51 employees, while the overall organizational development index points was about 4,800, which is not that great. The company currently has about four product lines, Swift Micra, Kisan Micra, Figa, and Kids. They largely cater to two major segments, which are car racing enthusiasts, and people who are interested in collecting cars as a part of their hobby. While the company has currently have three variants of Power 8, Power i9, and Power i10, the market comprises of four different segments. It was found that kids and racing enthusiasts do not prefer Kisan Micra across various territories, while they liked kids as a product. Teenagers, car collectors, preferred Figa, while teens like Swift Micra more than any other product. You would need to take cognizance of the various segments which are currently operating in the market, and we would get to know more about them in a couple of minutes from now. Uh, the first year of production did not see much of uh, capacity utilization, and there were a lot of uh, issues and problems with quality. And, and most of the issues uh, were because of uh, storage issues, they had machine-related problems, and more importantly, they had problems with the supplier from whom they had sourced the product from. There's a huge market potential. The demand of the products uh, you know, across all the territories uh, were phenomenal, where some of the territories did not show much of interest on a few of the products. While the company is still in its nascent stage, the international markets have opened up and the company has the potential to export and get into joint venture with countries such as USA, Russia, South Africa, Brazil, and Australia.